Yo, 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 all my game musicians out there, this is the Amnatious Zobo. Dubbo, oh, sharp for short, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Uranium. So, yeah, um, take two of this, because this was also part of the, the ever-losing session. And we stopped here at this Nest training house, this Nest, um, EV training house, which, um, had this dude, who, um, gives you the opportunity to enhance your HP for your, any of your Pokémon, which is actually pretty interesting. Unfortunately, um, my bird is down right now, so he won't have a chance to participate because, you know, shenanigans. So I'm gonna try out these two Pokémon before we move right, uh, right along. So, there we go. So, oh, wow, so far so good. Luckily, I am... Well, now that I said anything, I will get the shorter end of the stick, but like that. I'm probably going to get another another very short end of the stick here. Yeah, like that. There we go. Awesome. Not awesome, but awesome. That was actually kind of bad, but it, it's the same, um, it was the same number of EVs I gained um, last time too, so it doesn't really matter that much. But yeah, 14 EVs is not quite that bad. Now for, um, now for my, um, fourth chair. Uh-huh. Luckily, I'm getting a little bit better and quicker at this, so... So I guess that's... That's definitely worth something. Awesome. That's actually pretty good. Four, four stars all uh, uh, until that. Fifteen, yes, that's that's pretty good. It's pretty cool indeed. So yeah, my Pokemon gained some kind of an improvement there. So yeah, no, uh, no harm, no foul. So now let us venture eastward to uncharted territory here. Let's see, are we gonna be ambushed? Are we gonna be ambushed really soon? I think we will. Because again, I know all about this. Oh, oh, oh! That also reminds me here. That reminds me. Let's actually change to my bigger guns. There we go. Now let us. Yeah, I think we are supposed to go past these rocks here yet. Oh yeah! You've made a grave mistake. Now our whole clan is our whole clan is here if I can read. Our boss will sink you. Boss, Hokage is unbeatable or Hokage or Hawk Edge or whatever. Or Hokage, I'll just say Hokage. So this is Gaijin, trespasser who dared to surf on our turf because get it, surf and turf. Show him boss! Uh, do not interrupt because you're, after all, a grunt. So, you are a strong Pokemon trainer without an article. But by now, you are weak and tired. My Pokemon are strong without, without an accent mark over the E. Speedy, stealthy, it always wins the race, you know. We rule this part of, part of C. For the honor of my clan, we punish you. Okay, we're back to this. We're back to this same old song and dance. Thankfully, this time, my... I think my concert master has enough thunderbolts to hopefully take this, or not. I guess I don't. I kind of spoke too soon. So um, I'm gonna try this out here. I'm just gonna give it the benefit of the doubt that I can hopefully restore my Pokemon, my Pokemon's um, PP here. Hopefully, I hope. Uh. I Guess what? I'm not gonna heal up my e I'm not gonna heal up my APP because apparently that just causes issues. Yeah, you know I'm. Yeah, I think that's just a bit of a programming error. Oh, there we go. That was kind of a close one. This better not. Okay, good. I didn't give devastating damage, which is good. So I will take that. I will tolerate that. Now, you won't tolerate my Thunderbolts, though, I can assure you about that. 
because I have the power of Zeus by my side. Excuse me, Gengar, because I, after all, only worship one god, and that's Gengar. And now my ace is at its quota for right now, so let me switch out right now to someone who might prove to be also quite useful against these bitches, or bastards, whichever, depending on the, depending on the gender. Like, Tuberiel is a male, and looks a great deal like, um, the first boss from Super Paper Mario. Except smaller. And a lot bulkier, I guess. Uh, okay, please, please, don't you dare maim me, me. Okay. Guess what? Back to my ace. Uh, so much for that. So much for that plan. So much for having my other Pokemon have their have their chance to shine. Okay, you just made a fatal mistake. Oh boy, my attack was cut in half. Oh boy, whatever shall I do? You're still not gonna. You're still highly vulnerable, though, Gyarados, especially against a Thunderbolt, which, given that you're a Water and a Flying type, that you really don't stand a ghost of a chance here, or excuse me, a bolt of a chance. So there. What's next here? Tuber Reel again. Sure. Give it all you got. Hit me with your best shot, even though it's probably not going to do anything for you. Come on, can we now finish it off? Yep. Yes. It turns out that everything is now in my favor. Take that, computer, in your face. And don't you di Vaporeon, okay, that was a bit underwhelming. I didn't really expect to have to see you so soon. However, you know, to be fair, Vaporeon does have... It does have pretty good, pretty good defense if you just... If you just train it right. If you just Eevee train it right. It can have very, very bulky defense. So, yeah. Hmm. Acid armor. Okay. Okay. Well, hopefully... If I just... Okay, now you are a jerk. So, yeah, thank you for prolonging this fight. Thank you for making this fight a little bit more interesting, I suppose. But still, I never thought I would see that. I guess it just didn't... I, I guess the thought never crossed my mind that... Even a, even a boss like you would have to have potions or some kind of medicine. Yay, now you're starting to make me feel very impatient. Yay for playing the waiting game again. Can we get done with this fight? I like to get done before midnight. And that's no joke, guys. I'm playing this right before midnight. Because... It is New Year's Day earlier for me. <laughs> I'm celebrating New Year's Day earlier. <laughs> and my ball is going to be crashing down on me in about 10 minutes. So better have that spot of tea. Better have that spot of tea and, you know, my, my final prayers before the ball drops down on me and just instantly kills me. <laughs> okay, there we go. Daikatuna. <laughs> Krakatoa! I don't always make that reference. Okay, you must be the evolved form to the evolved form of um that Sidene guy. So Oh no! Oh boy. Can we take out this Daikatuna as fast as we can? I wonder. Can we take out this I wonder if we can take out this chainsaw of a fish. This chainsaw like fish. This rather mackerel-ish chainsaw. Yeah, we could. And with that, we get a very warranted level 46. Herc. Okay, that's all you have to say is Herc. Nothing like, oh no, I got bested by a 10-year-old kid. Oh no, I guess I should probably throw my belt in the ocean or something. No, it cannot be. Can the prophecies be true? That one comes who is stronger than I? My ninja honor and superstition commands me. I must bow down to your might. Boss! Henceforth, your Hokage. These wa waters are yours. I must leave. 
and you're now going to probably drown and never be seen again. Uh, yeah. Everyone's speechless, so I guess you're our boss now. Oh, hail the new Hokage! Hail Ninja Clan! Uh, guys, I'm really modest. I'm not really your... I'm seriously not your new ninja leader, even though I know you guys want... I know you guys want to think that I am, but I'm not. Ninja's away! Re Don't you mean Ninjago? Oh yeah! Ninjago! Because that's a really good show. Hmm. And, oh, say hi to Nia for me. Are we actually at a town? You know, we're on we're on an island though, so we must be getting closer to town. And what do you have to say, gentlemen? Hello, I'm a traveling Pokemon doctor. Here, your Pokemon look a bit worn out. Let me patch them up for you. That is awfully generous and hospitable of you, sir. Thank you very much. I wish you luck on your journey. And I wish you luck on yours. Just the same old man. Ah, dang it, I got spotted. You're lost. I can read it in the cards. No, you can't. You're not a real psychic. You're just a Gerard. With an Espeon. Who is one of my favorite Johto Pokemon. Because I Roy, I don't know why, but I'm just... Even today, I'm just heavily obsessed with the... The psychic type in general. I mean, after all, um... When I was a kid, I actually imagined myself as a gym leader. Of some region, and um... And I just kind of thought to myself, if I was going to be the gym leader of the Dakota region, my type that I would specialize in would be Psychic, so... Yeah, and my ace would be Alakazam, because Alakazam was my favorite Pokemon at the time. And it's still kind of this. I see, I see. So, yeah, I was identified as a Psychic from a very early age. It is a difficult burden to bear. I wanted to become a musician. But I instead watched The Matrix and watched this girl bend a spoon and taught it to Neo, and then that's how I became a psychic. Okay. <clears throat> Whoa! Oh, okay, you're a spritzy. Okay. Should I bother catching you, I wonder? Hmm. It's worth it. I think it may be worth the shot here to maybe catch another Pokemon so far into the game. Because I only have four Pokemon so far, I might as well deal with a third, with a, with another one. If I can get it down to red health, which I probably won't. No. Oh well, it was worth a shot. Now you, you're ne no. I guess not. Now I have to catch. Him. Oh, ah, oh, oh, Jack Deary. Now you're gonna be a part of my team because you look very, very sprightly, very, very eager to battle. Okay, please. Hopefully you don't faint in one hit. Please, don't you dare faint in one hit. Yes! Yes, you are a part of my team. You are going to be a part of my team here. You're going to be a part of the orchestra. So now I'm going to give you three chances here. Will you pass the audition, Jack Deary? Because I like your name. It makes a good musician name, too. What am I doing? Don't be so absent-minded. Okay, Ultra Ball, go! Did you pass the audition? Did you pass the audition, Jackie Deary? Jackie Honey, Jackie Blue. Yes, yeah, I, nope! I, I guess you didn't want to pass the audition just yet. I guess you didn't want to be a part of the Allstate Orchestra just yet. Because of reasons unknown. And guess what, I'm gonna use, I'm gonna throw an Ultra Ball at you again, and hopefully you're gonna pass the audition this time. Come on, I'm giving you a few chances here. I want you to pass the audition, and I'm not going to give up until you do. <sighs> Stop using Calm Mind. That's starting to kind of grind my gears a little bit. It's starting to really grind my geary mind. The gears of my mind are just turning ever so haywire. Come on, Jack Deary! I'm giving you a chance here. I'm giving you an opportunity that you can't refuse. Come on. Oh, hey, guess what? I'm gonna sing you. I'm going to sing you to sleep. Because I do believe, if I'm not mistaken, I do have sing on me, no? I better have sing on me. High jump kick. 
Uh, okay, that was kind of a close one. Now I'm gonna hope for the best that Sing is gonna do the job. Come on. Please, oh please, Sing. <laughs> sing, Zoro! God, this is embarrassing. I can't believe I'm. I can't exactly catch a rabbit. It shouldn't be that hard to catch a silly rabbit. Tricks are for kids. Now I don't even eat tricks. Oh. Come on! I will keep using this. I will keep using super potions until you manage to sing correctly and properly, Zoro. Please don't fall asleep on me, buddy. I am relying on you to help me catch this son of a bitch. This mad hair. This mad as a March hair hair. Come on, please. Can I just manage to catch this guy? Thank you. Can we sing you to sleep and finally, you know, just kind of kidnap you into I'm passing the audition? Okay, grab the sack, guys. Grab the sack. We're, we're not going to give up here. Ultra Ball, please. Oh, please. Almighty, please. Come on. Pass the audition. Pass the audition. Thank you. Oh, I can't believe it was that hard. The catch rate was very, very feisty at this one. Anyway, Jack Deary, Jackalope Pokemon. It is related to Buneary, but it is much more crafty. It conceals itself using trickery, so many people don't believe it exists, because it is, after all, a Jackalope. Okay, there we go. And I guess I'll just give it one more battle before we put this game to bed, guys. Move aside, peasant. You're blocking my view. Okay, you're a rich boy. Because no one else calls me a peasant except a rich boy like Rich. <laughs> and yeah, hello Emperilla Godzilla. You look like you came from the land of Gigarilla. Which is actually a real name from from Star Fox Zero. It's a stupid name, but it's actually a real actual name from the game. It's a reference name. Oh, that was Kinda bad. Haha, <laughs> you still got paralyzed anyway. It's not gonna do you any good. I mean, the paralysis is only gonna last for just one more shot. One more. Hey! Oh, okay. So, yeah, I'm guessing that's your. I'm guessing that's your special ability. That's your specialty. I'm just gonna guess. Beaten by a mere commoner? Oh boy, how dare you? Oh, I never. Anyway. You may have won, but my daddy is looking to buy this entire island. Who cares? When he does, I'll tell him to forbid you from coming back. Oh boy, I'm so scared. I'm so scared that you're one whiny little bastard. You probably got molly coddled when he was three years old. But yeah, anyway, I am going to say right here, guys, and next time on Pokemon... Pokemon Uranium. I feel a lot more accomplished here than I was last time, so yeah. See you when I have the chance to recharge my batteries. <laughs>